Well, hundreds of people marched in downtown Tampa today to honor those who gave their lives for our freedom. News Channel 8's Lindsay Master shows us how the Carry the Load event is encouraging participants to do a little more, all in remembrance. Many of these people are military, and they're here to honor their fallen family and friends. I'm remembering a fallen friend who uh, passed away or died in Iraq. Justin Poole is carrying his friend's picture with him today. For him, Memorial Day is tough, which is why it's important he's here with his comrades. Coming together as a team to help grieve and celebrate their lives. Carry the load began a few years ago when a former Navy SEAL wore a 60-pound pack to remember friends he lost in combat. That's why today many are carrying packs of their own. What's in it? Yeah. Bricks. <laughs> Milton Kingsley is carrying it in honor of several people he knew. It's 45 pounds. Some organizations walked in honor of military suffering from fatal mental wounds. We brought all of our veterans together to do the hike and in memory of all everyone who's killed themselves from PTSD. Memorial Day weighs heavy on Terry Lynn Sugar Robertson. Everybody that's on my mind is everybody that was in my dad's unit. Um, he was the only survivor out of them, so, and he deals with PTSD. So this is a daily str struggle, not only in my family, but my friends. As Poole marches, he carries a 24-pound pack and the Marine Corps flag to represent his friend. He's smiling down on us. In Tampa, Lindsay Mastis, News Channel 8. Today, the organization raised more than $8,000 in donations with the Carry the Load event.